Hello, my name is Nathan Krauss, and I'm the pastor of Redeemer Lutheran Church in Jamison, Pennsylvania. At this time of shelter in place due to the coronavirus outbreak, I'm aware that many people are viewing our videos and might want to know a little bit more about us and who we are. Uh, you can go to our Facebook page as well as our website and find out a little bit more there. But I thought I would offer this video uh, and explain a little bit about who we are and how we understand ourselves as part of the larger body of Christ. Redeemer is a part of the Evangelical Lutheran Church in America, which is our Christian denomination. It's the largest Lutheran denomination in America. You can go to our website, elca.org, and find more information about uh, who we are and what we believe, as well as the different ministries that we have here in America and around the world. We are a liturgical church, which means that our worship services follow a liturgical format. Uh, so we'll start with uh, one element and then move on in an orderly fashion uh, through the worship service. Uh, this is in contrast to some uh, Christian denominations that start off with um, uh, 15, 20 minutes of music and then uh, hear uh, a sermon for 45 minutes and then another uh, section of uh, music to end their worship service. Uh, for us, we move through the worship service uh, reciting prayers together, uh, hearing the word uh, of God, God, and uh, then hearing the proclamation of the gospel through uh, a sermon message. We're also a sacramental church, which means we believe in the sacraments. Um, two specific sacraments, the Eucharist, also called communion or the Lord's Supper, uh, is the celebration of the body and blood of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ through the elements of bread and wine. We believe that uh, Jesus is present in, with, and under the elements of communion, and that when we share communion, we're sharing uh, with all Christians throughout the world, as well as throughout time and space. Uh, we're also um, belief, believers in baptism, which means that um, uh, there's one baptism, and whether you're baptized in our Lutheran denomination or another denomination, uh, we recognize that as the true baptism since God is the one truly at work there. Uh, we also practice uh, confession and forgiveness. Uh, so our worship service will have a, a confession that we do corporate, uh, corporately together. It's a very general uh, confession of our sins. And then we hear the true word of absolution, uh, forgiveness for those sins. Uh, so we have elements of word and sacrament as part of our worship service. Uh, we're also a confessional church, which we, means we believe in the, uh, the creeds of the church, specifically the Apostles' Creed, the Nicene Creed, and the Athanasian Creed. Usually we do the Apostles' Creed, but there are also times that we do the Nicene Creed, um, and uh, very rarely do we do the Athanasian Creed, as it's a little bit more complicated and deals mostly with our understanding of the Holy Trinity. Uh, we're also a um, evangelical church, which means we believe in witnessing to uh, the goodness of God uh, throughout the world. Uh, the motto of our denomination is God's work, our hands. Uh, this means that it's our hands going out into the world in order to do God's work and bring uh, the gospel to people through word and deed. Um, therefore, those two elements are very important, witnessing to our faith with our words, but then also through our actions. And finally, we are an ecumenical church, which means we believe that although we are a Christian denomination, we are not the only Christian denomination, that there are other denominations, there are other Christians throughout the world, and that we believe um, that they have the true witness to the gospel as well. Uh, specifically, we have relationships with the United Methodist Church, the Presbyterian Church USA, the Episcopal Church in America, the United Church of Christ, and uh, a few other denominations as well. Uh, this means that we uh, can share table fellowship together, as well as every element of the worship service, recognizing the true gospel in each of those denominations. We also are open to dialogues with other faith uh, traditions and other uh, groups of people in order to better our understanding of our own relationship with God and with our neighbor so that we can fulfill the greatest commandment uh, to love our neighbor as Christ has loved us. Well, I hope that this video has been informative for you. If you have any questions, I'd love to sit down and talk with you sometime once this is all over with. Uh, you can email me at pastornathan at 
redeemerjamison.org. Uh, you can also stop by some Sunday and uh, enjoy worship with us, where you will be welcome to the table and, uh, and the body of Christ. Therefore, uh, we uh, hope that you have a blessed and, uh, and healthy uh, day, and that we will see you soon. Take care. God bless.